Okay, so I am using my Emergent Blender. So now I'm allowing that to simmer. I'm going to try it, taste it. Mmm, that is delicious. So I was going to put some eggplant in there, but I decided not to. The flavors are coming from the tomatoes, of course. <clears throat> and tomatoes escalate the flavors eight times more we got all those herbs in there the basil the the um, zucchini it, it it plays as it's, it's a twofold because it plays as a a, a valuable um, food plus it's a filler and then you have your onions and you have um, your carrots and if you wanted to add some celery to that, like a mirepoix, of course, you might want to add that. But I kind of wanted to keep it a little bit simple and, and escalate the other flavors. This is so delicious. Um, once it gets jarred, then um, you can add some other, like you could add it to your meatball sauce or if, uh, if you want to add, if you want to do cremini mushroom pasta, you can add that. I could add some cremini mushrooms to that, but I'm not going to. So, I, but I, I have the main ingredients, the bell peppers and the, and of course the wine. I added the wine in there, so I added a, a lot of wine. <laughs> it's a Cambernet Sabillon that someone gave me, and that should be a really good meal, a pasta meal. Okay, I hope that helps.